Hey guys, Sergeant Mushroom here for you with another OTP video tutorial. So today we're going to be going over how you can create perfect team accounts, how you can create another account, and how you can access your account and view it online. So of course the first thing you're going to be looking at is the right side here that says perfect team. And we're going to be going down here to the new user register button, which you will be using to create your account. So the first thing you're going to do is type in your account's username. So we're going to do just Jared Kellenick here. Doesn't matter what you put, just whatever you want as your uh, cool name. Next, you're going to do your email. So I'm going to put in my email and you can put in yours. And next, you're going to reconfirm it right here, just typing the exact same thing. Um, just a side note, you will never need to access your email again for this account. You will just have to uh, confirm that you actually have one. So we're registering, and now, as it says, we need to go into our email to check and follow the steps. So here we are. Next, we need to either click this button, which will automatically authenticate our account, or we're going to go here and manually do it, which is what I will do uh, this time around. I will show you guys how to do the other way the second time. So obviously, we need to enter our email address right here, so I'm going to put that right in. And then we're going to put the token that we had in. So I just copy and pasted it in and click the authenticate email button and that will do it. So now we can head back into perfect team and click the OK button right here. Just type in your password as your username should be automatically entered. Hit enter or click the login button and here you go. And you're set up and good to go with your perfect team account. Uh, it's that simple. There's nothing else you need to do. You should be at this point ready to go. So. Uh, now we're going to create our second account. Note that you can create up to three accounts on a single out-of-the-park baseball license. And uh, you will need a different email for each of them. So uh, just something you're going to want to keep in mind. So once again, we're going to click the new user register button when you're ready to create your second account. We're going to type in our new email that we are using for this account. And once again, we will be confirming it at this stage. It's pretty much just the exact same process as it was for the last one. Oh, yeah, and it would be nice if I actually uh, typed my email into the right spot. So here we are going to be Julio Rodriguez. And I hope I'm spelling these guys' names right. I'm not too good with all the names. And next, we're just going to type in our password. Once again, the exact same way it was before and as it said last time we need to now head to our email account and this time i'm just going to click the button and this one's even easier it will automatically authenticate your account and now we can just close out and go right back in type in our password and we should be good to go for perfect team and here we are with julio rodriguez now if you wanted to access your team's uh perfect your uh challenge mode numbers uh, the first thing you could do is come in here. You can click your account right here. And now you're just going to type in your username, which is, I think that'll be the Jared Kellenick thing here. Your password. And here it is. So now we can view our profile. Uh, it looks like they don't have out of the park 22 registered. Yeah, it's saying 18. So um, hopefully they'll update that sometime soon. But in the meantime, you can go through it here or you could just type in challenge.otpdevelopments and then hit enter. Uh, and here it is right here, the first option. So we'll hit the login button and it'll be if you want to type the whole thing in .com slash login. We're already logged in. It'll just be the thing that I already showed you guys. And then you'll be able to use all your challenge mode statistics once they get it set for 22. Um, if you're doing an older version, which I believe would be anything between 18 and 21, it will be available for you there as well. The process of creating a perfect team account for Out of the Park 21, which is the only other Out of the Park uh, perfect team base still running. Uh, it will be the same exact process. And also note that your out-of-the-park accounts will transfer between each version, so you don't need to create a new account for each one. Uh, you just log in with the one you already have existing. So if you're transferring from Perfect Team 21 to Perfect Team 22, you just use your same account for Perfect Team 22, and you'll be able to get going right away. And that's really it for this one, guys. Uh, it's pretty simple setting up an account. 
Of course, if you have any questions, be sure to reach out to the Out of the Park Development staff. They will be able to help you with anything you need. Uh, I hope this was useful for you guys, and I'll see you guys on the next one.